Hello everyone, this is Travel Guy 38 I'm coming at you guys with another um, product review here. This is a solar panel. It's the SynQ G600, and I've had it now for about six months or so, and uh, we took it camping this summer, and it's a great little uh, power unit. It's got a 300 watt hour, or 299 watt hour um, battery. It's uh, got a continuous sine wave output of 600 watts. It can boost all the way to 750. And yeah, um, it's it's been a great unit. I got it. I got a really good price on it. I think normally it's three hundred bucks, and um, it's very simple. It's got a nice light on the back um, that is really useful if you're camping um, or if you have a power outage emergency. And so this was yeah, three hundred originally, and we got it for it was two ninety. It was one ninety nine on sale, and then there was like an extra Amazon thing. So I ended up picking it up for. I think 167 and you could probably find a good deal on it as well. Um, and um, here's another little hack that you can do. You can put in a little USB uh, car charger thing if you're trying to maximize your USB um, output. But anyway, let's plug in a couple things here and I'll tell you about this power station. Um, I've got a computer here. Uh, I'll plug in this computer. I'm sure it's going to take... Plug it into the USB-C. Um, so you can, you know, push this button to activate uh, the certain uh, USB-C. So there we go. So we're getting about 5 watts on the little computer here. Uh, let's plug in a fan. Let's do some D some uh, some AC here. So i got a fan over here. I think it's going to be about 30 watts. Actually, it might be a little bit more, actually. Let's see. Uh, does it want to work? No, my fan doesn't want to work. Okay. My fan, oh, here it goes. Okay, there we go, the fan's going now. Cheap fan, doesn't always work. Uh, so yeah, the fan's pulling 48 watts here, as you can see. So yeah, I mean, it, it pulls uh, pretty well, it's pretty powerful, and I also have an induction cooktop that with a low setting of um, 600 watts, and it'll run that for about 28 minutes before it dies. It's a 600 watt output, but it only has um, a 300 watt hour battery. And so I would say my review on this thing is great. It's really simple. It's got lithium ion batteries. It doesn't have the lithium phosphate batteries. Um, but I love the simple interface. I wish it had a little bit more information to tell you how much time uh, remained. And I also wish it had a more specific battery meter to tell you the percentages. But yeah, it's been great. Um, I've used a solar charger on it. Um, the one downside, it can only, it maxes out at about 91 watts of input, and that's for wall and solar. Um, and it's, I believe a car charger would probably be the same, about 100 watts is the max input. So that's the downside. But if you can get a good deal on it, I think this is a great power station to have. Um, it's simple, um, it never really overheats. And it's worked really great, and I don't regret buying it. So yeah, this is a very short review for the SynQ G600.